Yo, what is going on YouTube? My name is Brandon Nunez. If you guys are new to my channel, I'm an A1C in the United States Air Force. And as you guys can see from the title, I'm doing something a little bit different for my channel. We're gonna be attempting the Army Combat Fitness Test today. Special Zamora, Corporal Del Rio, and we're going to be going over how to conduct the ACFT, the Ombat, the Ombat, the Ombat, Army Combat Fitness Test with Brady over here. We're going to teach him the ropes, we're going to teach him how to do it, and hopefully to the best of our knowledge, complete it. Sweet. Alright, so what's the first event? Uh, the first event is going to be the hanging leg tuck. There are some pretty significant changes to the current Army fitness test. The biggest one being that this new test is going to be genderless and ageless. No matter if you're male, female, 45 or 20, it doesn't matter. The standards are going to apply to everyone. And the only thing that's really gonna differentiate the standards is going to be the difficulty of your MOS. The combat fitness test is currently going through field testing. So what that means is the test itself is actually being tested. The current standards are just tentative, which means that changes can be made and the test isn't gonna be officially rolled out until October of 2020. Also, it hasn't been made clear what order these events are going to be done when the test is officially rolled out. So this video is more to show you guys what's to come in the future in 2020 for those of you who are thinking of joining the army. Yeah, I think I only got 10. The Rio just made that look hella easy. That's actually really hard. My body kept like twisting to the side, but apparently the minimum is only three. So I guess I'm good. All right, so next would be the, the trap bar deadlift. All the events have real world carryover or they're supposed to, and they kind of almost simulate something that you would do in a combat ready environment. What this event replicates is picking up ammunition boxes, a wounded battle buddy, supplies, or other heavy equipment that can be found in any deployed environment. Oh. That shit was hard. All right guys, so the third event is the hand release push-up. It prevents people from not reaching 90 degrees because between every rep, your hands actually have to leave the ground. These are actually really tough. The max amount you can do in two minutes. So. I got it. You got it? So he's gonna run a timer real quick. We believe the max might be 50. Well, like we said, it's all tentative. Um, it's not fully into effect yet. So we're just gonna see how many we can get. Just having some fun, guys. Trying to challenge ourselves a little bit. So, let's do it. Get ready. Get set. Be good. My wife is watching this. <laughs> Pretty good at push ups, cardio, <laughs> stuff like that. <laughs> It's about to suck. Get your hands off the ground. Like that? Yup. Oh, okay, okay, so. So it'd be like this. Yup. Okay. Ready, get set, begin. 
JB first one foul gal playing ball now the whole city love you a how but we know they wasn't down from the get go dirty got a dozen rounds better get low all right guys and this sprint drag carry is a fourth event this is a series of sprints First, it's a regular sprint, then you drag a 90 pound sled. You also have to sprint with two 40 pound kettlebells. This simulates either carrying ammunition, pulling a friend in a combat situation. So the next event is the standing power throw. And in this event, soldiers toss a 10 pound medicine ball backwards over their head. What this simulates is the soldier's ability to either lift themselves up or even lift a buddy over a wall, something of that nature. But as I mentioned in the previous clip, we were attempting this test more so to challenge ourselves and the day this was filmed we weren't even doing it with competition in mind. I had the idea while I was editing this video to throw that aspect in there just to add a little bit more fun. Um, so as it stands right now, I ended up losing to the army because the last few events we kind of messed up when it came to recording our times. So we don't really know who the true winner was this day, but if you guys do want to see a full competition video like this video up and i'll be happy to do that it'll be a ton of fun we're done with all the events all we have left is a two mile but i'm just gonna get on a treadmill and do it real quick so appreciate you guys helping me out with this yeah. definitely fun it's good meeting you too nice meeting you bro yeah so yeah we had a little bit of fun i'm gonna knock the two mile out we're gonna call it a day i love it when they count me out i'm a soldier i'm a soldier love when they think i ain't cool because I'm, I'm sober you used to love when we was down we was closer yeah. But I stopped loving ever since I got fucked over Hold on, call me, I don't know you